Greetings gents, I'm Geo Fatboy for ShaveNation.com. Today I'd like to perform a shave with this new Feather SR Super Razor, Japanese style razor. This is the one that has super grip on the handle. On one side here it says Feather made in Japan and then on the other side it says professional. Very easy to grip this even with soapy or shaving cream laden fingers. No problem whatsoever gripping this razor. And you know to load it all you do is squeeze the spine and then you can slide the blade right in even without touching it through the injector or you can pull it out and drop it in. Either way. You may or may not know there are five different proprietary blades that go in this razor. The Soft Guard, the Pro Guard, the Light, Professional, and Super Professional. I've shaved with the Professional and Super Professional before. They're very good, it's very similar to a straight razor using those blades. I have not used a Pro Guard, and the Pro Guard is made to be forgiving. It's made for beginners, so I thought I would try the Pro Guard today and see how it works on some pretty heavy beard growth. This blade has, if you feel it along the edge, it has a wire guard on it. There's little notches along there and that's what makes it more forgiving. The other blade, if you feel along the edge, not the sharp edge, you don't want to run your finger along that, you may cut yourself, but if you feel along the edge of this one, it's totally smooth and very sharp. You can see that. All the others, the professional, super professional, that's how they are. So I will perform a shave today with this Japanese razor. Let's just, I'll pop it out so you can take a good look at it. Here's the wire guard. You can see the little notches on there. And let's drop it in. All you do is squeeze the spine. And the blade will go right in between the blade holder and just drop right in place like that. Once you release, it stays there. It's not going anywhere. And here is a look at just the regular professional blade. You can see the edge is very smooth. No wire guard on that, no notches on that. So I've got it loaded up with the ProGuard blade. Let's see how this works on heavy beard growth. Let's see if we can mix a lather. I'll fill up my marble brush soaking cup with some hot water. I'll be using the Parasso Omega board brush today. That's what it looks like dry. Let's drop it in there. Saturate it. It's a nice stiff brush with a good sized handle, preventing you from getting shaving cream on your fingers while mixing your lather. Let that soak. We just got these in stock. This is DR Harris shaving cream. And this is a sandalwood. Comes in sandalwood, rose, lavender, Marlboro. There's a bunch of almond. There's a bunch of different scents. Mm, good sandalwood. Not as, not as strong as Tobbs, but very nice and sweet. Lightly scented. Okay. I'm going to take my Shave Nation bowl right here. The red bowl today. Lather spot at the bottom. I'm going to warm this up under the hot water. And I'll just scoop out a little bit with my shaving cream scoop spoon. Just going to scoop out a little bit here, about an almond size amount, just like that. Pour out the water from the bowl and just drop the shaving cream right in there so it lands at the bottom, just like that. Remove, remove the brush, pour out the water, go directly in and see if we can start swirling. See what kind of lather we can make here. Immediately starts foaming. Mmm, that smells really good. Plenty of lather, 15 seconds. Just keep depressing the tips of the brush down into that lather spot. And you'll build luxurious lather quickly. Look at that, it's coming up around the sides. Scoop that back down, push it right back in. And the more you swirl, the more lather you will get. Yummy. Very nice. Plenty of lather for several passes right there. Let's set that down. I'll warm up my face. We'll get right to the shave. All right. My face is good and warm. I'll dry off my fingers. 
Let's lather up. Grab our bowl and our brush. Here we go. Start on the right side. Just work your way across. As I said, this is a good stiff brush. You can really drive the shaving cream into your beard with this. Excellent shaving cream. Smells great. Lathered very easily. Let's see how the cushion is on it. Little figure eight. The Zen moment right here. Smooth everything out. All right, let's set that down. Let's clear the runways so we can see our sideburns. All right, here we are. The Feather SR Super Japanese Razor with the Feather Pro Guard blade. Let's see how this works out. I'll temper it under the hot water. We'll start on the right side, cut that sideburn. Work your way down. Very nice. Just a couple strokes. Takes it right off. It's filled up, let's rinse that. Lots of stubble going down the drain. Left side, same way, cut that side burn. Excellent. Filled up. Lots of stubble on there. You can see that. Let's rinse that. Now right down the chin. Excellent. Rinse that. Rinse that. Now the mustache, you can just scoop right under the nose. Left side. Very nice. Okay, let's rinse that. Just a quick face rinse. And we'll relather. Just a light coating. Set that down. I don't even have to clear the runways. Look at I left those parts open, so I'm not going to worry about it this time. Try the fingers. First pass was with the grain, north to south. Now we'll go against on the neck. Very smooth shaving. Great blade for beginners. Let's rinse that. Now the other side. Excellent. Now we'll go across.
beautiful. The other way. Excellent. Chin. Left. Okay, let's rinse that. Feel around. You can stop right now. I am super smooth. Really nice. But let's go against the grain on the cheeks. Just a little bit of shaving cream here. I'll show you how to do this. Right hand, left side. My hands are wet, you can see. I can still grip this razor very easily. Stretch the skin a little bit. Just work your way up. Beautiful, look at that. Super smooth like a baby's butt right there. Let's rinse. Now the other side. Awesome. Fantastic. Okay, let's rinse. Hot then cold water rinse on the face. Let's take our Shave Nation Wide Stick Allen Block, remove the cap. Just glide that all over. You might get a little bit of stinging when shaving with a straight razor, but that's totally normal. Let that soak in for about 30 seconds, then rinse it off. Pat the face dry. And since we use the DR Harris Sandalwood Shaving Cream, we'll go with the Parasso Sandalwood Aftershave Balm. Just layer those on top of each other. This is the red box. This just came out. Remove the cap on this. It's a nice thick balm, excellent for protection during the winter months. Right into the skin. Massage it in. Take your towel and fold it in half. A nice cool finish to the shave right here. Okay, that was a fantastic shave with the Feather Japanese SR Razor right here. Loaded with the, where is it? The ProGuard blade. I had heavy beard growth and this took it off no problem whatsoever. I'm actually surprised. I thought it would have a tougher time, but very smooth, forgiving, very nice shave provided by this ProGuard blade and the wire guard. It really does its job. So if you're a beginner and you want to try your hand at straight razor shaving, you can go with the Japanese version. There's also a folding version. I'll put a link to it up here. You can check that out. I have a review of the folding version as well, so you can see that in action. This is a great place to start, especially with this ProGuard blade. Excellent place to start your journey for straight razor shaving. The good part is you don't have to sharpen anything, no honing, no stropping, no stones, none of that. You just pop a blade in and get your shave on. That's the best part of these razors. And these are the cream of the crop of Shavette style razors, replaceable blade, straight razors, because the system of loading and unloading, when you're done, all you do is squeeze the spine. You can pull the blade right out like so, just like that. And when you need to clean it, just squeeze, pull it apart, boom. Take your little brush, your nail brush, and just clean it up. Reassemble, very simple. Squeeze it, push it back in, nice and easy. The DR Harris Shaving Cream Sandalwood, very easy to lather, smells fantastic. Nice cushioning, excellent shaving cream. Highly recommend, good stuff. Not as strong as the tabs, like I said, but still a fantastic sweet little scent on it. No problem mixing the lather in the Shave Nation bowl. 
right here with the Omega Parasso bore brush. Still got lather left over. If you wanted to do more passes, you could. And then finishing up with the Parasso Sandalwood Aftershave Balm. Very good stuff. The Shave Nation Wide Stick Allen Block. Just apply it to your wet face after your shave. Let it soak in, then rinse it off. That'll give you some feedback on your shave. It's a natural astringent, natural product. It comes from the earth. Can also be used as a deodorant. Yep, check it out. I'll have links to all these items underneath the video. Just click where it says show more, just like all my videos. Click down below where it says show more and you can grab the products right there or go to shavenation.com, enter what you need in the search box, and it'll pop right up. Please do me a favor before I head out, smash that subscribe button down there and then ring the bell, that icon, ring that. That way you'll be notified of all my upcoming videos. They'll go right to your inbox and you won't miss any. Thank you very much for watching. Visit ShaveNation.com for all your shaving supplies. I'm Geo Fatboy. Have a great shave. Have a great day. Uh-oh. Looks like I have a 4 o'clock shadow. Gotta go to ShaveNation.com. Have a great shave. Have a great day.